All right, problem one involves splitting apart a URL. So the first thing I need to do is get a URL. Let's just go to the browser and type in something like www.vanderbilt.edu. So I'm just going to copy this and assign this to a variable called URL. Okay, uh, it says use the split method to break the URL into pieces based on the position of slash characters. So let's um, Split the URL by the forward slash. That looks good. Okay, so suggesting a variable called URL underscore split. Um, that sounds good to me. Let's try that. And let's print the split URL. And while we're at it, let's print the type of URL split just so we can see what kind of thing it is. So let's try that. All right, I've got to select a kernel, take it a minute to get started. Okay, so it's split the string into three pieces. The first one's HTTPS. The second one is the empty string because there's nothing between the first and the second slash. Then www.vanderbilt.edu and there's nothing after the last slash. So there's two empty strings in here. And the kind of thing that it is, is a list. All right. So what is the index number for the list item that contains the domain name, like Vanderbilt.edu? So remember that we need to start with zero. So HTTPS is list item zero. Then empty string is list item one. Then the domain name is list item two. So let's put a comment here. All right, write an expression for the domain name and print it. Ah, okay, well, look, it's already suggesting that. It's the second item in the URL split list. Print the domain name. Let's try it. www.vanderbilt.edu